Hi, hi, hi. I'm rushing out the door to Pilates, but I just wanted to hop on really, really quick because I keep seeing this comment about the calories, and I just wanted to show you, uh, this is the sourdough bread from Trader Joe's. I'm sure you can look at some breads at your local grocery store and find sourdoughs with the same um, four grams of protein per slice that this has, but also you could use keto breads, low carb breads, like different types of breads, experiment with it. And you could probably A, boost the protein and B, even reduce the calories. Now me personally, not a huge fan of some of those low carb breads. And my goal is not to reduce my carbs. My goal is just to boost my protein. Um, so for me, I'm in love with the sourdough and I'm going to stick with it. But I just wanted to show you it's a hundred and it's so hard to see. Hold on one second. It's 120 calories per slice for the sourdough. You can like pause to read the rest of the uh, information on here. And then this sourdough, it's four grams of protein, like I said, and it's 24 total carbs, but 22 net carbs because you have two grams of dietary fiber there. So that's for this particular sourdough from Trader Joe's. Again, you could choose a different bread. I don't think that will fundamentally change what we're doing here. This is the cheese that I used, okay? This cheese, it says sliced light cheddar cheese, 50% less fat, 25% fewer calories than their regular sliced cheddar. Again, I think you could definitely find this. And I think also probably a light Swiss would do similar if you like Swiss, if you like that flavor. This is 80 calories per slice. And we used four slices, 8, 16, 24, 32, right? Um, so that's 320 calories for the cheese. Again, you could... Go in higher or lower cheese, eight grams of protein, and one carb, according to this. So that would bump up your carb just a smidge. So I just wanted to share that. And then, of course, the butter. Um, I would say that I use two tablespoons of butter. I wouldn't say that you eat two tablespoons of butter when you use my method where you put it in the pan. I would say about half the butter ends up staying in the pan that way because the bread which is part of the reason that I like to do it that way is I feel like it's less greasy than when you paint it on. Um, and if you, for the mayo lovers out there who said, oh, I like my grilled cheese with mayo instead of butter, you could probably use a light mayo and reduce the calories. But a tablespoon of butter is 100 calories. So if you add that uh, to this total, what were we at? We were at um, 8, 16, 24, 32. This is 240. Um, so that's 560, I think, something like that in that neighborhood. Uh, I don't know. We're not here for math. You can do the math. Um, so I think that's pretty good for a meal. If you add the butter, I would bump that up to six. So it's somewhere between five and 700 calories, depending on if you use butter, mayo, whatever. And slight adjustments to these ingredients could reduce that. For me personally, um, I don't actually eat a lot of calories. Um, not a big problem I actually struggled to to eat I know it doesn't look like it because I'm overweight but uh it's really more about getting more protein into my body and obviously building more muscle this channel is not a health food channel okay we make family food easy food and we learn basics in the kitchen I just wanted to tell you on my personal journey I'm trying to boost my protein I thought this is a really cool way to like cheat the system because it's a grilled cheese sandwich and it feels like a treat and I love that it can be high protein as well um, because I'm trying to get 120 grams of protein into my body every single day. And I hope you guys have a great day and I hope to answer your questions. I'm gonna go to the comments and try to answer everyone's questions. We're gonna make roasted tomato soup today. I'm gonna do the tuna melt still. Um, we're gonna try one in an air fryer to see if we like that. That would also reduce the calories because you could probably use less oil. And I love you guys and I hope you're having a great day. So. Off to Pilates.